serious. Because when we wake up, the blood sugar in our blood, the sugar in our blood is normally low. So you don't have energy or any kind of any kind of strong will to do anything you want. So at the time you will lack of energy and it's really hard for your brain to work as well as all the body in your body, especially your muscles. So if you uh, if you skip uh, skip your breakfast, if you will be sapped of energy. It occurs to most of people. So on the other hand, so many people don't feel it immediately because they are still got some energy left. But this will lead to the consequence that they will eat later because they don't have anything to their stomach. So the body will uh, produce something that makes them want to eat much more. And this is the reason why lead them to the overweight. So... I want that. I want that. What? I want it. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you can skip breakfast, but it's not good for your body because uh, gain weight is the state that you eat healthy, so it's probably enough. I eat healthy, so, and <laughs> I can wait. So the role of the breakfast is really important, as I said before. The body is the first thing that it has the result. It's good for your brain, it will it uh, prevents you from some disease related to memory, like Alzheimer or some kind of things related to the brain or headache or any kind of that. And next is your stomach, because in the morning your stomach is the the you know, again, uh, what the, the part of your body which works uh, the most effectively. So if you eat something healthy, so it also works effectively and absorb any nutrition from this food. And contrary to that, if you eat the bad things, your um, stomach will absorb everything and it also release everything in the end of the day. So you can see this real clear. If you skip your um, breakfast, you will know that your stomach is quite uncomfortable at the end of the day, like you cannot get into sleep well or sometimes you have to uh, make your body feel exhausted. And also it's really good for the, the bone because if you have enough nutrition from the back, uh, in the breakfast, you can provide adequate the nutrition for your bone so that you, it can develop really high up, really, um, yeah, it can develop well. And uh, this is the reason why so many children in the foreign country, they always add the meal into their breakfast and also in the lunch. And also the meat called uh, brunch, brunch, breakfast and lunch. They also have meal or some kind of things related to cheese and everything related to milk. They have the bone to develop because in the morning and also the time between morning and lunch, the bone will be much better developed yeah so it's for the body so what about the other the other cost of the other device it is will help you to lose weight if you if um uh in so many research has shown that if you want to lose weight you never skip your breakfast because lose weight doesn't mean you eat less it means you eat healthy and in the adequate number so lose weight it is the before or in the before when you um having the etiquette and nutrition breakfast and this is the time and after a long time that you've got the etiquette nutrition for your breakfast yeah and um, because why do you know the reason why <laughs> mr like you tell the reason why me yeah, yeah. Um, it um, healthy nutrition will yeah. help us to like reduce all the the bad nutrition bad a, a part of your body will not contain that like fat or kind of a proper portion of cholesterol kind for this low weight I am quite sure about the, the fat nutrition and when you eat properly the fat level will be very low and yeah. your the body will be thinner just like me thin mm -hmm. yeah. yeah yeah because the breakfast as i said before it will prevent you from eat, overeating later so if you if you provide your body the endicate things endicate nutrition 
So it will have need to be for longer time. So you will not eat or grab any fast food into your body because your body is full of the nutrients and food. And that's the very key reason for your losing weight. So the key things of losing weight is not you eat less. Once again, it's you eat healthy and your body is provided with the good things. So this is the contrast to this because this is the thing that when you skip your breakfast, many people don't know and also the scientific cannot sure about if you will be prevent all the disease if you eat enough breakfast. But one thing they really sure is that if you skip your breakfast, you will be gain weight so long time to do that. So never skip your breakfast so that you can be have um, you can have a very thin appearance and also good for your brain. And also in the breakfast, you need to add three things which contain a lot of nutrients and things for your body to develop. The first one is carbs or carbon dihydrate. Secondly, fiber or protein. Protein. Uh, carbs is something related to um, bread or cake or some kind of that. It is the thing that you must reduce most in, during the day because it just gives you the energy immediately, right away after this time. When you eat that, it will give you lots of energy, but it will also disappear soon. So fiber is will contrast to this. It will help you to have full of energy, even though you eat real less, but the, the number of uh, the energy left will be full of the day and give you feel more energetic. And protein, if you stronger, it also have fiber and also protein will combine to each other and help you to develop and live healthily. But carbs, it doesn't mean you quit it. You need to add it, but it's just some small amount so that you can never like um, be hunger of any hamburgers or pizza or any kind of that. Usually in this or this, but in this, the approximately amount. Appropriately. Uh, yeah, appropriately amount. So, <coughs> fiber is from Western uh, vegetable, and protein is some meat or meal. Cheese and cups is from some uh, cereal. I oh, know cereal is in the fiber, but cups is related to the uh, pasta or pizza or some kind of fast food, right? Yeah. And also, if the kid skip breakfast, this is the slide that I make for emphasizing the, the negative things when you skip your breakfast, especially for the kid. Because normally when we um, grow older, we are adult, so we cannot feel uh, hungry or serious about skipping breakfast. But for the kid, they are the one that show very clearly about the consequence of skipping breakfast. So I will talk about the kid. The kid when they uh, skip breakfast, they will eat later and also lead to the gain weight status of body. And also some kids who didn't or seldom eat breakfast will be high, um, hyperactive. I mean, they always want to do something weird and also always in the active status. So maybe they cannot develop in, in the normal way. And also they will perform bad at school because they don't have full energy or full energy for the brain to produce and work well. So it is very clear if they skip breakfast. That's the very, very reason why in the foreigner country, they always care a lot about the menu of the food for the students or canteens or everywhere, especially in America. They always have to check regularly once a week or once a month to every school so that they can make sure that the children are provided with the best food must be supplied from the market or supermarket. Yeah, so this is some of the sample morning plates. If you're really keen on cooking or you've got lots of free time, you can do this. But if you want to be simple, you can have this one. Because just, just for 12 sandwich, you can make 12 breakfast for every morning. And it also gives you lots of energy because sandwich 
have you to have carbohydrates. Avocado gives you the fiber and also the fat, but the like the kind of healthy fat. And egg have you to have it. protein. And any things related to healthy will have you to be healthy. So remember that what you eat will make what who you are. Yeah. <laughs> So this is the thing that I want to tell with you after the presentation today. So I always hope that you will have a very nice breakfast. Stay up late and don't stay up late. <laughs> get, don't stay up late and get up early so that you can make your own breakfast meal and you enjoy the most during the day because it will the key things help you to become successful or not. Yeah. Thank you. So do you have any comments or questions for me?